Happy Memorial Day weekend, y'all. Happy Memorial Day weekend. Hope you guys had a good one. What's up? I'm right in the middle of filming some. Today's gonna be fun. We're gonna get into a couple of different things. I have a really good conversation I wanna bring up or a thought that I wanna bring up to y'all. And in the meantime, we're gonna create a little look. I already have my face prepped because I wanted to get straight to the point, girl. I was thinking the other day, I was like, you know what? It is so important that when you have a goal in mind, the goal is not gonna happen overnight, right? I feel like a lot of people get caught up in the idea of like what could be and they never really focus on the vision and like executing the vision. So then when it doesn't come easy, a lot of people give up. Work ethic is like super key. Ooh. We're gonna do like a cool little blue situation today. And this is a Marc Jacobs palette, iconic palette number 760. I'm gonna use this blue right here. Look how bomb that color is. I think sometimes people think that success and things that you're doing and accomplishing come overnight and it's not true, dude. There's so much that people do that people don't see behind the scenes, you know? It's taken as like, oh, that's an overnight success or oh, that came easy, but to be successful, a lot of sacrifice comes out of it. Always. You always gotta sacrifice something if you want something. I know for myself, I moved out when I was 17. I was just like, look, I'm out of here. There's more to life, I feel like, so let me go out there and find it. Moved out, figured it out, and I'm so happy that I did it, but like, the sacrifice for me was taking a risk and being like, okay, this is your dream to be an artist and to be able to live off of your artistry and travel the world and, you know, do all the things that I'm doing now, but at 17, it's a little bit scary, you know, and but I, I knew deep down inside that I always had my faith and I always knew that God was never gonna leave my side, no matter what, like whatever. So, first of all, bomb. I love this. If you wanna be successful and you know, you wanna be the best that you can be, because I definitely feel like don't try and compete with anybody, don't do that because it's like, there's no point. The only competition is yourself. Every day I have to p compete with myself. Every day I gotta be a better version of myself than I was yesterday or the day before. It takes work. Look, sometimes you gotta just tell yourself like, this is only temporary, it's only gonna last a little while. Cause I remember when I was working at a restaurant and I was a waitress and I was like, you know what? This right here is temporary. You ain't gonna do this to emphasis. I just knew it in my heart. But you gotta keep going. Even if you feel like it doesn't make sense, you gotta just keep on chipping at that damn iceberg. Keep on chipping, keep on chipping. And if you know in your heart, one day it's gonna pay off, because I feel like our spirits talk to us and they'll tell us, it's gonna pay off, just keep on going. And there's times that, look, I'll cry and be like, I don't wanna do this no more. But somebody will come and remind me, hey, you doing your job in the world, or hey, you know, you helped me through this situation, like, and that's my little motivation to keep on going. Overnight success is not a real thing. You get something overnight and you don't have to work for it, it's kind of just not worth it. Like the lessons that you learn along the journey, I feel like are so clutch and it's so important to, for us as humans to pay attention as much as possible. I'm gonna go in with, this is called Risque by Huda. I'm gonna put it real close to my lash line at the bottom. Fire. Don't forget to blend your edges. Slick your edges and blend your edges. Mascara time. If you give yourself permission to live your best life and to enjoy what you got in front of you right now, I feel like magical things happen and it's just more of an enjoyable journey. Like, look, we all know we're going to go through some lessons. We all know, you know, that life happens and shit sucks sometimes, but shit don't last forever. It only lasts for a little while until you learn that little lesson and then boom, <laughs> move on to the next lesson. <laughs> it ain't got so good to us. Just lessons after lessons after lessons. I'm not saying life is gonna be perfect, but I am saying that there is a way for you to pay attention to the beauty in things, even though sometimes it's uncomfortable, but don't stay in that space of badness and doubt and all doubt. Do what you gotta do and keep being patient. So for blush, I think I'm gonna do this NARS Paloma one. It's more of like a bronzer blush. It's kind of like a pinkish with like a warm undertone. And then for my highlight, I'm gonna do Prosecco Pop from Becca Cosmetics. Becca and Fenty Beauty are my two favorite um, highlights. You already know. <laughs> It's 
from the Galaxy Collection from Fenty Beauty. There's a little bit of gloss. Cute. Thank y'all for watching. See you later.